Okay, that was a, it cut off so quickly. Cut off so quickly. So I'm gonna make this part three, and I'm not gonna go too much in the um because a lot of lot a lot of man a lot of people covered these things like from big toe artists to that to that red pill blue pill black pill you know white pill you know what I'm saying shit. Everybody covered it. What more can I say? I'm just reiterating them. I'm just regurgitating. Well, I ain't regurgitating. I'm just basically reiterating, it, reiterating everything everybody else said. You know, basically. So, it didn't hit a thousand points that I can just say over and over and over and I refuse. You know what I'm saying? It's just the fact that the black community is fucked up. All the communities are fucked up with single family homes. You know what I'm saying? And um, for the most part, I'm going to go biblical with this. I'm going to take it to the Bible. You know what I'm saying? Because I like to use the Bible for everything. Because it is what it is. Like, what are you going to use for a foundation? In the Bible. If you look in the Bible. And you read every page. Every word. You will not see the word girlfriend, boyfriend, relationships. You will not see those in the Bible. You know why? Because that's no such thing. There's no such thing as having a boyfriend or girlfriend. That's bullshit, you know what I'm saying? That's how motherfuckers get trapped. Like, oh, oh, that's my girlfriend. So you fucking her without being married? That part, see what I'm saying? And that's that's America right there. That's America and a lot of other countries, you know what I'm saying? Supposed to be married. It was a time in America, like the 60s, the 50s, the 60s and back. I could say even probably like the 70s, you know what I'm saying, and back, you know what I'm saying, where the legal age for a girl to get married was 16 years old. Can you believe that shit? The legal age was 16 years old. They raised the age limit to 18. Who cares? The fact is, they had the age set that way because people was getting married. They, you know, like, bitch, you got a husband? Get the fuck out. Go live with your husband. As long as he could provide. You know what I'm saying? He had a home. He had a job. He could provide. You know, get out of here. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. And that's a fact. That's a fucking fact right there. You look that shit up. You don't believe me. But in the Bible, there's no such thing as girlfriend, boyfriend, relationship, you know, fuck buddies. You know, none of that shit. And you did not read some man hanging out with another woman and fucking if they wasn't married. They would just hang out and we fucking. Now you read that if, 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 if it was like some bullshit going on. Like the story this dude went to the, um, he went to what did the, the Benjaminites. He went to the Benjaminites, you know what I'm saying? And, and he gave one of his bitches up to them and they fucked that bitch and they killed that bitch and they cut that bitch up, you know what I'm saying? No, 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 they fucked the bitch and killed the bitch. So what he did, what the guy did, was he took the bitch, he cut the bitch up, and he sent he sent each piece to them niggas' houses that killed them. Each piece of the body sent to them niggas' houses that killed them. And the rest of the motherfucking tribe of Israel went after the, after the tribe of Benjamin like it was nobody business, you know what I'm saying, for what the shit they did, you know? Now, if you don't read your Bible, you probably don't know that story. If you go to church and listen to the pastor but don't read your Bible, you probably don't know that story. But that story is in the book. You know. Now, unless some acts like that go on, another thing. King David, he was on his deathbed, man. He was on his deathbed. He was dying, man. He was dying. So they say, yo, bring a young, emphasis on young, hot, pretty, sexy thing. Bring that young tenderoni there and let her lay down with the king. See if he gets some heat. See if his dick arise. But... His dick didn't rise. They're like, oh, this nigga's out the door. This nigga's out the door. So they let the girl sit there and tend to him until he died. That was his bitch. But he never got a chance to fuck her. So later, his son, Absinol, what was his name? Like some shit like that. He went and tried to take the kingship. But Solomon moms went to David before he died and said, didn't you promise that my son would be king? Why this nigga went up there trying to take the kingship? Paraphrasing. So he was like, you know what? Called such and such, blah, blah, blah. Tell him to get my mule, you know what I'm saying? Take take Solomon up there and announce him king. He did that. You know what I'm saying? Solomon was king. The oldest son, you know, that nigga got scared. Nigga ran. Everybody's dispersed. Pew! So King Solomon, he was young. This nigga was like, nigga was like younger than 10 years old, you know, when he was king. So, um, I bet y'all didn't know that. 
Y'all know so much, but y'all know that. But anyways, he spoke to his older brother because his older brother asked his moms, asked all their moms, God, I want a request, but don't deny me. All right, what is it? Can I get um, daddy? He just, we wanted Solomon. He wanted David's young bitch. And he never got a chance to fuck. He wanted her. So she went and asked Solomon. And Solomon said, why don't that nigga just ask on my throne? Man, from this day forward, man, I'm telling you, that nigga's a dead man. And he went and had him killed. So, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Those are instances in the Bible. But you never hear or read the Bible that that man and that girl was boyfriend and girlfriends. That word is not even in the book. There's no such thing as a boyfriend and girlfriend. What is that? We just dating. There's no dating in the book. You would not even see that in the Bible. The word dating. They were dating. That shit isn't in the book. That word is not in the book at all. At all. You read it. Every word. Just skim through it and see if you can find they were dating. No. You either get married or you don't. You don't go out with her and meet and talk, see, we vibe and get to... That's, that's bullshit. Nobody gets along with nobody. That's how it is. We are all individual people. We got our own individual minds. Adam didn't even get along with Eve after she did that bullshit and fucked the serpent and had the serpent seed. The Lord said, I'll put empathy between your seed and this seed. Because she was pregnant with the serpent seed. Come on now. But y'all ain't know that, nigga. Did y'all? Uh huh. Yeah, that part. But, anyways, you either married or you're not. There's no dating. There's no dating. I'm saying there's no dating, there's no going out on a date to see if we 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 connect and all that. That's bullshit. America came up with to pacify 